I'm sorry. Hey, Fetch. Just stumbled across a bit of your handiwork. Think maybe you want to dial it down a notch? Gotta feed the fury, dude. Or maybe you don't feed the fury. It'll starve to death and you become a people person. Like me. Or, or maybe you can bite me. That'll help. Yeah, take that, you poison peddling garbage. It's what you deserve. Hey, Smokes, you want in on this? Yeah, yeah, you still need help? Don't need it, but I'll take it. Next one. Just keep following the markers. So, uh, how'd you like killing those dealers? It's a fuzzy joke, ain't it? You know, maybe we should tone it down with the dealers. You going soft on me, D? Hey, we have powers they don't. Means we have to be the better people, you know? Cut them a little slack now and then. Just think about it. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Just go get yourself some more power.
Ah, there's the sauce. My bad, man. on. You first. Pick up the trail.
Mitch, I uh, see you've started taking these dealers down alive. Can't help but think I had something to do with that. Yeah, all you egomaniacs think you're the reason for everything that happens in the world. No, I don't think I'm the reason for everything. I mean, just your highly visible change in behavior, that's all. <laughs> it tickles. Whatever that was, I heard it from here. You know, anytime you want to actually hang around for one of these things... I've been thinking about what you said before. About the drug dealers on the street. Oh, yeah? The way I see it, going after those ass gum dealers is just small time. But going up the food chain a little, finding the supplier, that'll change things. Well, I'd be glad to tag along next trip you make up the food chain. Just I don't think I've ever actually changed anything before. Sure. It'll be a date with a death toll. I'll give you a call if anything comes up. Thank you.
Girl, you got people to see and your powers to steal. Okay, promise you won't be mad. But the good news is you can start without me. Oh, face the danger alone? Gee, that is good news. Listen, I found out a major drug shipment came in a couple days ago and it's stored on some boats there at the marina. All right, on some boats at a marina. That's all the details I need. It's a big shipment, so it'll probably be houseboats. And this group uses a dolphin as sort of their mark, so I look for anything on a boat with a dolphin on it. Better. But don't wait for me. You never know when they'll start offloading that stuff. So what held you up? Girl stuff. Ew. What kind of girl stuff? Putting some serious hurt on this drug-dealing scumbag until he sold out his friends and told me all about this goddamn drug shipment. Fetch, I'm on the docks. And I'm here on the roof. What, you couldn't wait a few more minutes? <sighs> this is why I hate working with girls. matter. Yeah, drugs. Hey, Fetch, I'm gonna tag all the boats with drugs to make it easier for you to know which one to take out. Man, can't you ever go like five minutes without tagging stuff?
There you go. Made it easy for you. No wonder it took me so long. Fetch, you said dolphin, but clearly uh, this is a porpoise. It's a common mistake. This is why I hate working with boys. Nice shot. Boy, I heard something. You didn't tell me there'd be girls at this party. So I heard. Dealers must be using their hookers as human shields. Supposed to be a pretty big shipment. Gotta be at least one more boat that's holding. Any women of ill repute being held hostage on this boat against their will? Uh-oh. Looks 
like we stirred up a hornet's nest back here at the warehouse. Coming. So, ready to storm the castle? I say we wait him out. Make him come to us. Oh, good. Sit and wait. My favorite strategy. And why don't you join me on the roof here and enjoy the fireworks? I'm about to light up all the drug boats. It's a lucky thing you were able to let those women free before we blow up the boats here. No kidding. You ready? Let's light up the bay. Well, that's three less evil dolphin boats in the world. Three less porpoise boats. Don't worry, it's a common mistake. D, wake up. They're on the move. Probably moving some stuff to their main location. We should follow them. Let them lead us to it. We should stick to the rooftop so we don't spook them. You just gotta be careful not to lose them. Hey, Fetch, can I ask you a personal question about that DUP detention center? Curtin K? Yeah, that's the one. No. I mean, what do you want to know? There were maybe four, maybe five hundred of us. A few of us were separated out, given special training or tests. I was one of the separated. Seven years. Separated. Curtin K was hell. He was also home. 
Actually, I was just going to ask if it had a pool. You're a jackass, you know that? <laughs> yeah, so I've heard. They pulled into the alley. This must be the place. All right, so what's the plan? Uh, get them? Get them isn't a plan. Somebody in the truck. All right, ladies. Come on, let's go. Yes, the bad men are gone. Go, live, love. Just not professionally. If you want to get clean, now's the time. There won't be any more drugs on the street. Don't screw it up. And they're gone. Do you think a couple of low-life bioterrorists will ever get thanked for saving people? Yeah. I think you might have saved me. Oh. So what, are you gonna give up on your whole ritualistic murdering of drug dealers? It's like half your charm. Oh, yeah? What's the other half? Actually, that was it. You... just the one charm. Don't worry, I'm not giving up on my passions. Just... finding some new ones. Oh! Like boxing. Oh. Is that like your whole attempt at a tender moment? Ah, oh. you are a sentimental psychopath, aren't you? Come on, let's just get the rest of these drugs in the harbor. Maybe we can get a few fish strung out. Man, hook a dolphin. Hey. Uh, you like me. <laughs> Hey, just woke up.